Agriculture remains just as important to New Zealand's economy as it has been in all of those years. And that's why it's crucial that we tell our rural stories so that people understand farming and that they understand its realities and its challenges. It's the strength of our science, the strength of our farmers, um, the strength of our education systems and our leadership, I guess, as a nation that's got us to where we are. 25% of the nation's GDP is bound in our sector. We can't afford to get the model wrong. Hyperspectral imaging or hyperspectral sensing is an extremely versatile technology to visualise. You can imagine we're generating a lot of data, nobody's really interested in data, but if we can give you visible uh, visual images of what you've got, then we think that's a far more usable thing to, to do. And visualisation of data is going to become more and more important, I think, in the future. Farmers have a lot of data, but equally the industry um, organisations we deal with um, have a lot of data, which could also be useful. Data link has been created to make it easier to share data across the sector. You're looking at, at the management and, and the skills surrounding that. You're looking at information and, and what you can bring together to allow you to make decisions. You're looking at the overall farm systems that you're running. A combination of, of those three drive profit uh, out at the other end. We need to shift away from producing a product that we think is right for the market and then saying, how much are you going to pay us for that, for that product? We need to connect with those markets, connect with those consumers and produce something that the market wants and the market needs. Whether if it's rugby, farming, business or sport, in the end, it was all about the people. Everything that we do within our business, with what we do, requires people. And we can either have them working with us or against us. And for us, it's a more important process to have them with us.